everybody, it's Brooke. I hope you're all doing very well. I am here to show you my current design team project for our friend Julie J at the old design shop. I am loving, loving, loving these two bundles. Um, it is called Feminine and Julie has two bundles. There's Feminine Set 1 and Feminine Set 2. You guys won't even believe how many images you get. It's insane. And the price is fabulous. I will, of course, link both of those bundles in Julie's shop down below in her Etsy shop. I've printed out just a little bit to show you guys. And this is not even all of the images you get with these two bundles. Look how beautiful they are. And you can see why they're called feminine because it's cologne labels and beautiful Gibson Girls, that might be a Harrison Fisher, but I'm not sure. No, maybe not. But I just look at all the variety you get, you guys. A vintage calling card, and that looks like an old postcard. And some black and whites. Well, they're really kind of sepia and black. And more images and ads. And just with these two bundles, you could entertain yourself and make journals and ephemera and tags and tucks and pockets, as Elizabeth says, for all of eternity. You'd never need anything else. So this is Julie's. Uh, these are Julie's bundles. One would be sufficient, but hey, at Julie's prices, why don't you go ahead and get two? Oh, ha, par pardon my fingers. Yes, I have indeed lopped off my fingernails until the salons open, and I was out digging in the garden today. Not feminine, feminine. <laughs> so yeah, these are, these are just, as I said, a few of the pages of images you get in Julie's fabulous bundles at the old design shop. And I will link those down below in the description. Now for my design team project, I didn't just describe what Julie is offering. Nope. I actually made a digital kit with all these fun images. So let me show you what I made. Uh, I made a digital kit that has five kind of journal pages or collage pages. It's got five background pages and three pages of add-ons. So um, some envelopes and tags and journaling cards and things like that. So this is the first page. Hopefully you can see that okay. And they are folded because I was making sure that they printed right. <laughs> they don't come pre-folded. You gotta print them out yourself. This is the second page. And the colors are just beautiful. There, Every color was in there. There were pinks and blues and greens and yellows and peaches. Just the images that Julie picked out were fabulous. And here's more of a collage sort of page. So you can see where these would be terrific folded up <laughs> as a journal page, which is what I did. Uh, or you could just cut things out and, and collage your own self. Here's another one. Oh, I love this one. I just had so much fun playing with the images. And these are flowers from Julie as well. These are the other five pages. Uh, the first five were sort of journal pages, collage pages, whatever you wanted. And then there are five background pages as well. So there's this one. And then there's this one. I made a collage of lace and ribbon and scanned it and cleaned it up. These are light enough that you can write over them. This is some fabric that I scanned. It's beautiful vintage fabric. Uh, and I overlaid some digital vellum and stapled it down with digital staples. And then there is this one, which is um, a vintage end paper from Julie's shop as well. And I kind of combined it with some ledger and some painting and things like that. And then you have this, which is a bunch of the different ads from Julie's bundles. And I turned them all one color and then layered on a rose pattern. And there's some green detail in the back. And then there are the three pages of add-ons as well. And then the, these are the add-ons. You can see that there are four tags up here where I extracted images and layered and did some more. Then there are some, uh, I think these are three by four journaling cards. And I was thinking with these, I printed on heavy paper. I could just print something on the background and cut them out and 
boom, they'd be done. Or you could just cut them out and boom, they'd be done. Then here's one that's upside down and you have an envelope that you can cut up and fold. Here's a pocket that you can cut out. Here is a layered guest check that uh, could either be a tag or a pocket or whatever you'd like. Here's some page tabs. And then these are some labels that you can cut out. Looks like my camera is auto-focusing. That's weird. Oh, it is. Sorry, guys. Alrighty. And then the last page of the digital kit is this. And you get a giant linen. Well, it's not really giant, but it's half of a page. And that's one that I own that I went ahead and scanned and cleaned up. And then you get some words. And these are words that I superimpose over a piece of fabric from this doily. So they're nice and textured. And let me see if I can hold that up closer so you can see that they're aged and textured and just fun words to use when you're collaging or making a journal. So that is my design team project for Julie at the Old Design Shop. Again, I will link these fabulous bundles from Julie um, called Feminine 1 and Feminine 2. Those will be linked down below in the description. And I will also put a link in for my Etsy shop if you would like to buy the digital kit. And I'm telling you, between all three of these items, you guys, you'd never need another digi kit as long as you lived. So I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you run over and get the digi kit or Julie's digital downloads or all of them and have yourself a play. Tons of fun, vintage, feminine items to play with. Thanks so much for hanging out with me today. I hope you're having a great day. You guys stay safe, stay well, and please still stay home. Bye. Love you.